Hello and welcome to CIA. My name is Mayank and in this video I am going to continue the editing of a contact or any other object using Motic REST API. So the screen that you see is the documentation and uh, documentation I have gone to edit contact. So there are two ways to edit a contact. One is a patch type of request and one is put type of request. These are the basic differences that you see from the documentation. But there is one more major difference which I will have to demonstrate. So this is my base URL. Then I append API at the end of it and then we have contacts. So let's go on and create a new contact first. Right. So let me create a new contact first. And the request type will be post. Let me pass three parameters. Okay, so I have passed three parameters, first name, last name and email. So let me create the contact. Now the contact is created and the ID is this one. I will copy the ID and show this in Mautic. So now this is the contact that we just created. So we have first name, we have last name and email. Now notice, next what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a put type of request. And in this request, what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the last name part and I'm going to change the first name to second and the email remains the same. Oh, sorry. I did not pass the uh, ID of the contact. So first I have to pass the ID of the contact and add it. And uh, this will be as per the documentation. So, okay, let's uh, go back and click on send again. Now, uh, as you can see, the request was success. Let's check it out in Motic. So, as you can see, first we have first name, last name and email. Three fields we have and uh, FN1 and LN1. So, let me refresh this. Open it. And now you will notice that the last name is gone. So, this is what happens when you make a put request. The fields which you are not passing in the request here are removed and what you pass is only remaining right so let me show you again for example if i remove the first name part and make the request again and refresh it here so now you see we only have the email left at the same time when we want to keep the existing part and also create another part so what we can do is we can do the patch instead of put we use the patch the url format is exactly the same and now notice that i'm removing the email and i will just pass first name and last name okay and i'm going to make the request notice that i have not passed the email so if you do the same with the put request the email field should have been gone but in this case let me refresh and as you can see we have first name we have last name and email all of them so now uh, if i just want to change let's say last name or add the value for any new field let's say company and make the request and refresh it here again Right. So now you see that the last name was updated, email and first name was not touched and company field was added. So this is the major difference that you need to keep in mind when you are using Motic REST API to edit the contact or edit any other object for that matter. Right. So you have to keep the difference of put and patch in mind. So what happens now is um, let's say I pass some random ID here. Right. And as you can see, this is a patch type of request and I click send. So Motic is returning 404 item was not found just the way it is demonstrated in the documentation. But at the same time, if I just change this request to the put type request, then what will happen is a new contact will be created. Notice that this is the ID 61 here and the ID returned here is 62. So let me just show you this new contact. And the information that we passed was 
last name and company name so based on this field the contact was created when the contact is not found or when the id is not found so uh, this is how you edit any of the object using motic rest api so the i hope the difference of put and patch is clear in the put the whole object is updated and you have to pass every field if you want to update every field but in the patch you only pass what you want to update or what you want to edit so this is the major difference of put and patch and in the case of put if the contact is not existing contact will be created in case of patch if the contact is not existing it will return 404 thanks for watching please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed already in the next video i will be talking about the filters and how to apply them so there are a lot of filters when you are trying to fetch uh, a list uh, of objects so all these filters we will talk about in the next video stay tuned subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up